So I bought a van for the business, okay? And I think that uh, it is a must have as soon as you can. Ready? All right, if you're here for the first time, don't forget to subscribe. Um, today we are talking about the van. Oh man, it's like I wish I did it a long time ago. It should have been my first car. Uh, well, first car since I started the um, production film business. I thought I needed it, right? but I found out that I really needed it. I got a Ford uh, Transit. Um, uh, it's a 2016 Ford Transit, and I think uh, I think it was a great choice. Even right now that gas is really high, I'm still surprised. Like, you know, wow, really? I already used it to my first uh, event in Las Vegas. Now I drove all the way from California to Las Vegas. Of course, I, I live in uh, Palm Day, which is like uh, three hours away from uh, Vegas. So um, I drove it down there and that's when I really knew the value of the vehicle. It was strange actually working in Las Vegas. It felt really strange. Like, am I really here to do a job? Like. You know, it's a spot where everybody comes to like chill out and have fun, but it was business time for me. I talked about my new business uh, um, and maybe I will elaborate in another video, but it's, um, it's event uh, videography, like event coverage. Um, I decided to go into events because um, if you know my background, I'm into music. I was into music and I'm still into music, but that's gonna be in the future. Um, so I wanna get a quint, I wanna get, you know, acquainted with uh, events again because it's been a while so I wanted to just get in that niche and then you know focus on events and you know grow from there and then get into actually hosting the events myself so that's been my plan um, and uh, that's why I chose to niche it down you know because prior to now I've been doing freelance work basically doing any gig available but uh, I soon found out that you know it was smarter to niche it down but uh, my website, which is gonna be ready soon, um, is gonna be all focused on this niche, which is event um, production, corporate events, basically. This van has come in clutch. It's like right timing, okay? So um, I'm gonna um, take you through the journey, like show you the clip of how it, how it was, how it came when I bought it, and um, uh, over the time I've been working on it, so I'm going to take you to the journey because I don't want to make it a long video, so I'm going to show you uh, how it came and the work I've done so far. Then probably in the next video, I'll show you um, how I load it up because it's really important. Luckily, I got a van that already came with the cargo. I wanted the one with the cargo because um, the trouble of going to fix those things in myself, I just didn't want it, so I looked into like financing with uh, uh, a brand new one, uh, but they usually came without a cargo, without a cargo compartment, which means I have to go fix them up. And then if I have to make them do it, it's like skyrocket prices. I took my time and searched and searched and I found um, this one, uh, 2026 in, in LA, and I went to grab it uh, real fast. So um, I, got, I, think I, got a, I think I got a fairly cool deal. Um, and um, I had to get it. So I'll show you some clips. And one of the things you need to know is that um, I, as a van owner, you need to have some accessories, you know, because, uh, um, because of the vehicle, you are blindsided, you can't see um, you can see through your rear mirror, um, so you need to equip yourself with the camera and, and all that. So I'll, I'll let you know uh, my choice uh, walkthrough in another video. But for today, like I said, let's stick to 
checking out the video, the before and after, which is like temporarily because I'm going to do some more work from time to time. I'll update what's going on with the van as soon as you can. If you're really doing, if you're really into production and you're doing work, you're going with a lot of equipment every time, it is advisable that you get a vehicle, a van, if you need, even if it's going to be your only car. Uh, downside is that it can only um, take one passenger in front um, with you because you're not going to be having those seats at the back. Um, but it's definitely worth it. Transportation, safety of equipment and uh, all that. Plus, you're going to have, you need to have uh, the uh, back rail, uh, the, the um, partition. That's a, that's a must have uh, because you don't want your cargo, um, your, your equipment flying and hitting you in the head. Uh, I stumbled into another business which, which kind of merges with my event uh, um, coverage and it's the 360 photo boot. Um, when I eventually wrap the van, it's just going to be a natural flow because I will use the van to cover both events if um, I'm hoping that I'll be able to do both events like um, have somebody in charge of the 360 while we shoot or or be or vice versa whatever the case may be um, thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys in the next video Woohoo.